I am Shankar Raman. If you think that I have any difficulties or have any doubts about my capabilities, don't have any such misgivings. I am as capable as anybody else in the world. I believe that uh, the disability should not be considered as a constraint. It is a condition where one can work with and be productive. I was four years old when I still vaguely recollect that I was taken to a hospital in Bangalore. A lot of medical treatments were given to me. I always thought that I was like anybody else, but I did not know then that I soon was to be confined to a wheelchair life. I was diagnosed with muscular dystrophy. During my life standard, I started stumbling and falling. My hands became shaky and I could not draw or paint anymore. My back became so weak that it started to develop a curve. He faced a lot of struggles in life, both psychologically, physically, emotionally, everything, because he was deteriorating constantly. And whatever he was able to do one day, even the very next day, he wasn't able to do. At one stage, I had to be in a crawling condition and uh, later moving on my bottoms. By the age of 15, I was totally paralyzed. The fury of God was unstoppable. That was a, a big uh, impact on me that made me feel I am not capable of anything. And suddenly I started uh, losing friends, I don't have people to talk about. I am not able to go to school. I didn't want to show my weakness to my parents and sisters that would make them feel unhappy. My turning point was I got excellent marks when I finished my 11th standard which uh, surprised many of my own family people including my parents. That gave me a lot of encouragement and the confidence that uh, I can do well. Myself and Shankar Raman studied together and completed the Charanavaran Si course in the year 1995. I learned from him that if one can overcome this barriers, then sky is the limit. I have been in Charanavaran practicing for more than two or four decades. Sri Shankar Raman did articles under me and completed his CA in first term. He, though he was disabled, he never expected any facilities from us. I was just 22 years old when I started practicing and my disability was not welcomed easily by people. The progress was not easy, but I never wanted to accept that uh, I am not capable of doing a particular thing. In 1991, I met one amazing man. He was Mr. Ramakrishnan. He had visions and dreams for creating a valley for the disabled people, which was a concept which uh, amazed me a lot. I could see the possibilities to bring out the potentials of the young children and transform the quality of lives of the disabled. I decided to stay at Amar Seva Sangam permanently with Ramakrishnan. Shankar Raman came to Amar Seva Sangam to see the activities. When he went through my 
డైరీ ఈ మేడ ప్లేస్ మైండ్లో హెల్ప్ అమర్ సేవా సంఘం హీ స్టార్టెడ్ ఆర్గనైజింగ్ అమర్ సేవా సంఘం ఇన్ ఎ ప్రొఫెషనల్ వే we had a vision of creating a township for the disabled with all facilities under one roof for any type of disability and we have progressed a lot the progress of amar seva sangam has astonished even me the number of children and the number of youth who have got a new lease of life is amazing and unimaginable i could see the children with disabilities lying behind their cots in the corner of their huts are now proudly roaming around on the roads in wheelchairs and tricycles in mobile bikes and earning their livelihood we would have catered something anywhere up to 3000 people with disabilities to have a good life we would have turned around more than 700 people from our institutional uh, rehabilitation programs and our survey has shown that more than 80% of them are well settled in life. Shri Shankar Raman, Secretary of Amar Seva Sangh, is another unique individual to refuse to accept physical disability. He converted all those into opportunities for a good life. Amar Seva Sangh is what is today uh, both Dr. Ramakrishnan Ji and Shankar Raman Ji. We salute both of them. from an institution which was hardly a 1 lakh budget organization has now become a 10 crore budget organization it is really the god's grace that we have progressed with this much i would like to see myself in that kind of an india where everything is equal and there is no disadvantage for disabled people Shankar Raman is a taskmaster, a hard worker, a professional to the core. Shankar Raman sir is a very good man. He is a world cup of the world cup. He is a good man. 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 Shankar Raman sir is a highly motivative, active, and inspirational man. He is a highly motivative, active, and inspirational person I have ever seen in the world. My perception is uh, Shankar Raman, he himself has a feeling that his best has not come out yet. Then that's my perception and probably he is striving for that. I am a person uh, who always want uh, challenges. I feel that um, the God has given an opportunity, a chance to me to prove my abilities. I am very fortunate uh, to live with a role model each and every day and he is a very inspiring personality and very hard working and a very good creation of God and uh, he is uh, always thinking about the development of the physically challenged and their upliftment. I don't know how to describe uh, our uh, 20 years of joyful togetherness. We also love to be loved. We also can have families. We also can have children. Can the society understand all this? Has the God been very biased? Or is our creation has any special purpose? These are the questions which I am still trying to find answers.